Welcome back to Motion Story Recaps. Today I will show you a computer animated fantasy comedy story title Turning Red. Mei Lin, Mei, Lee, 13 years lives with her parents, Ming and Jin, in Toronto in 2002. She works to make her mother happy while helping to maintain the family's temple honoring her maternal ancestor Sun Yi. She keeps her personal interests hidden from Ming, including her love of the boy band 4 Asterisk Town and that of her friends Miriam, Priya, and Abby. One night, May's strict and overprotective mother Ming learns that she has a crush on Devon, a 17-year-old local clerk at the convenience store, and unintentionally humiliates May in front of everyone. May experiences a frightening nightmare that night, involving red pandas. The following morning, she discovers that she has grown to be a sizable red panda. She runs away from her parents and learns that she can only transform during intense emotional states. May wears a tuke to school because her red hair doesn't change color when she transforms back into a human. May transforms and flees home in tears and fear after Ming humiliates her at school, which leads her to believe she is having her first period. In order to defend her daughter's end, her village during a war, Sun Yi was given this transformation, which has been passed down to all of her female descendants, according to Ming and Jin. These days, it's both uncomfortable and dangerous. So, on the night of a lunar eclipse, which will occur in a month, a ritual must be performed to seal the red panda spirit in a talisman. May finds that she can control her transformations by focusing on her friends, who are unaware of her transformation but enjoy it. May is permitted to return to her regular life by Ming, but she is not permitted to go to the upcoming concert by Four Town. Instead, the girls deceive Ming about how May is spending her time and covertly fundraise for the tickets at school by taking advantage of the popularity of May's red panda form. May consents to attend Tyler, the school bully's birthday celebration as the red panda in order to raise the final $100. May is disappointed when she learns at the party that the concert will take place the same night that she must perform the ritual. When Tyler makes fun of her family, she becomes enraged and attacks him frightening the other kids. When Ming learns about May's activities, she accuses her friends of corrupting and exploiting her. May fails to defend her friends because she is ashamed of what she did and is afraid to confront her mother. May's grandmother and aunts show up to help with her ritual, much to Ming's dismay. As May gets ready, Jin finds videos she made of herself acting as the red panda with her friends and tells her to embrace rather than hide this aspect of herself. As May's red panda form is about to be sealed during the ritual, she decides to keep her powers and leaves to go to the concert at the Sky Dome. In escaping, she breaks Ming's talisman, releasing both May and her red panda form. She finds her friends again at the concert, where she also learns that Tyler is a fan of Four Town. A furious Ming, who has grown to the size of a kaiju red panda, interrupts the concert with the intention of reclaiming May by force. May and Ming disagree about the independence of the former. May accidentally knocks her mother out during their argument. To assist in dragging Ming into a new ritual circle, May's grandmother and aunts break their talismans and take on the forms of red pandas. To complete the ritual and send May, Ming, and the other women to the astral plane, May's friends and four town join in singing. May and her mother come to terms. She assists her in repairing her relationship with her mother whom Ming unintentionally scarred out of rage before sealing her own red panda form. The other women use new talismans to contain their red pandas, but Mei chooses to keep hers, and Ming, that she is following her own path. Later, Mei and Ming's bond has grown as the Li family raises funds to fix the Sky Dome's damage. Mei strikes a balance between her obligations to the temple, where her red panda appearance has become popular, and her time with her friends who now include Tyler. Make sure that you've subscribe and turn on the notification so you can watch more videos like this. Thanks for watching.